Hey guys, Man Singing here bringing up Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. And so we got an update in the news recently about an upcoming maintenance on Global. Um, so this is going to be taking place in the early hours of Thursday morning for me in the UK. So this will be late in the evening uh, in various parts of the US. I suppose early evening-ish, I guess, if you're in Pacific time. Because I think you guys are eight or nine hours behind the UK currently. Um, so this will be going from uh, 2 a.m. for me until 8.30. So this is a six and a half hour maintenance. So make sure depending on your time zone, you've done all of your dailies and everything like that on the Wednesday and then can get on at some point on the Thursday once the uh, maintenance is over. So you don't miss out on anything. Obviously, whenever they have these maintenances that have unexpected delays, um, if they do cause... Uh, the timing to go over daily logins and stuff like that. They're usually pretty good about giving um, those things as like the extra rewards and stuff. But I think in game you still technically lose your cumulative login bonus. Not that that is particularly important for anything, right? It's the same few items just over and over again. Um, but I know people do like to build their numbers up. So be aware that this is a pretty long maintenance. Now, this is to release a new version update, and we're going to talk about the specific version in a minute, but the interesting thing is it's version 5.20.1, um, which actually puts Global one version ahead of JP, apparently. Um, now, there's a couple of potential reasons for this that we'll talk about when we show some of these other posts here. Um, but the main thing that we know that's being added in for this um, is going to be something that Truth showed off in a tweet here. So if we get this tweet up, um, there's now a cut in for additional supers. So basically, just like when you do an additional normal attack, you get the cut in of your character appear. Um, there is now a cut in appearing for the additional supers as well. So you can see here, seeing a super attack from uh, Broly. And then the cutting image comes up, kind of like a dodge, because it shows the battlefield screen. Normally what happens now is there's just that slight delay, and then it goes into the next super attack animation. Whereas now it shows like the battlefield in the background with the cutting, but and then there's still a momentary delay, which is very interesting because because that slight delay is still there, realistically, this doesn't add anything, like in terms of optimization or anything like that like it's obviously adding something in it's adding in that little effect that we see but it's not making uh, the thing go any faster or anything like that um so it's not really something that is making a huge difference um in the course of battle so but that seems to be the main thing that we know that is coming in the next version update uh, truth mentioned this and then there was some talk about what was going on um and then we have this post here from Goresh. Um, so there was a DM conversation that True showed here. Why would Dokon make this change? Is there some new mechanic tied to additionals coming? Uh, if so, maybe Tanabar next for Global. That's something we've obviously talked about that I've made a video about. So check that out if you haven't seen it. Um, and then, yeah, probably right. And they're going to tweet this out. So then Goresh uh, made a tweet here. Dokon just confirmed in the news on the JP version that they changed the timing of certain things on the battle screen in preparation of a future new feature and that it is not a bug. So potentially that means something is going to happen in that new timing section that has been added where it shows the battlefield and then the cut in for your character comes in. So potentially a new mechanic, something is going to happen in that spacing. Now, it's interesting to think what that could be because it's not going to be something that we've already got in the game, right? Because if it's something like the enemy dodging or negating your super attack, that happens already. That happens as your super attack animation begins to play and then the enemy cut in comes in and they have their ability that stops whatever is happening, right? Whether it's a dodge, whether it's a negation, anything like that, right? So that is something that is uh, completely different. So we'll have to wait and see what that is going to be. Now, the thing is, we're talking about the versions earlier. So remember, we're 2.0.1. There's a tweet from uh, Rick over here, a guy that posts a lot of interesting information from data mining, from the files in the game and all that sort of stuff. And he has tweeted out here, interesting that Global is getting 5.20.1 and not 5.20.0. So this is the version that JP is getting the update for to bring in uh, this super attack edition thing. Um, 
I wonder if they found another game-breaking bug during testing a couple of weeks ago and postponed the World Tournament internally, but decided to add all the client-side data anyway with a placeholder date. So this is a thing that happened before, right? When we had supposedly an upcoming World Tournament, but the uh, stuff in the data showed that it was going to be a year away from happening. Um, and we all wondered what was going on. And it was basically, they think they put a new a thing in the news a little while afterwards that some update, I think I remember back when it happened, someone was saying that it was to do with uh, Piccolo Jr.'s active skill and something that had been affected uh, with it, with the new update. And so, of course, they know, like, he's the most used unit for the World Tournament. Um, so I think the I think the glitch was something, if I remember rightly, that, like, when you use Piccolo Jr.'s active skill with the new update, the game would crash. And so obviously for the World Tournament, like everybody's going to be using Piccolo Jr. Everyone's going to be going into the World Tournament and then the game just crashes like straight away when you try to use his active skill. So that's something that they obviously didn't want to have happen. So they postponed the World Tournament in order to fix that issue. Now, it's funny that uh, we speculate this, maybe J uh, Global skipped a version because a lot of the time with these version updates, they are just copy and pasting the update from Global to J uh, from JP to Global, and that is what causes some issue sometimes. Um, and so this kind of makes sense for this theory to be true, that if they just copy pasted 5.20.0 over to Global, and there was some kind of issue that would affect Global, They've then fixed that issue ahead of time and dropped that extra version update, which is why Global is getting 5.20.1. And the thing that obviously lends some sort of credibility to this theory is that we do have the thing in the, uh, if we check on the Dokkan info, this is in the game data for the in the files for the scheduled release of these units. Uh, we have the Shen TUR Awakening. And then we have the easy A's for STR High School Gohan, Tech Mr. Boo, STR Super Saiyan Vegeta, the Int Jackie Chan, and then of course the easy A for the World Tournament LR, uh, Yamcha and Pua. And as you can see, in terms of the internal game files, the schedule, these units come out in a year's time, apparently. So I think the theory that they maybe had to push this back because of another issue with the update actually does make a lot of sense because if you look at the dates that we're on now we are basically a month away from when global had its last world tournament like based on the spacings between the two most recent global world tournaments a lot of us were expecting there to be a world tournament this weekend and obviously you know we're here now today and there isn't one and this is potentially why, right? Because of an issue with 5.20.0. And so Global is going to get a big maintenance to increase the version straight up to 5.20.1. So hopefully, uh, once that update is done, usually the data download is available as the maintenance is finishing. So of course, I will uh, be able to make a video since it finishes early in the morning on the Thursday. I'll be around to make a video to cover everything that's in the files with the new data download. But once that maintenance is over, we should see uh, this stuff updated. Um, and personally, I think if they've pushed it back by what seems like is going to be an extra week, we will probably see once that maintenance finishes next Thursday that the next World Tournament for Global is probably starting the next day. Although, of course, next... Uh, Thursday is going to be the uh, 30th so we could have a world tournament on the 31st last year on global the next Dokon fest released on the 31st so it could be either a world tournament or them dropping the new Dokon fest uh, which of course could be the Tanabata who knows I don't think they would do both on the same day but I could potentially see them doing world tournament starting on Friday the 31st. That goes over the weekend and then the new uh, unit comes out on either Monday the 3rd or Tuesday the 4th. Um, so of course we will have to wait and see what is going on with the schedule. But we should know all of that information once the data download comes out at the latest right next Thursday. We could see a producer letter or anything like that from Global before then. Um, to confirm what is next for Global. But as of right now, all we know for sure is that we're getting this maintenance on Thursday the 30th to update to 5.20.1. Hopefully that will fix whatever issue, because uh, they don't normally do this, right? They don't put placeholder release dates in the files that are for like a year in the future. So hopefully once the maintenance is done and we get the data download that comes with it, um, everything will become clear and we will know the uh, time and date of the next World Tournament for when these guys are going to come out 
or at the very least the release of the next unit that is coming out on global so let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section are you looking forward to a potential world tournament next weekend i know most people will say no but some people uh some mad lads out there absolutely will be and yeah, tell me what you think of the new mechanic for the cut-in for the additionals. What do you think the reason for that could be? What could be the new mechanic they could be introducing that takes advantage of that? And uh, yeah, let me know what your thoughts about Tanabata potentially being next for Global as well. Whole lot of things potentially going on. But by next week, like I say, at the very latest with the data download, we should have a bit of a better idea as to what is going on. So that is going to be it for the video, guys. This has been The Masked Ningen. Smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Check out the links down below for the Discord and the merch store. And I will see you all again soon. Have a good one.